Hey guys, just want to give you a quick update on the status of OS 10 Yosemite install for my Cintiq Companion. I'm booting right now from this external drive, connected to the top port, and then I have this shitty USB 3.0 hub connected to the bottom port for my external keyboard and to connect this Cintiq 22 HD that will hopefully give us some clues as to what's going on inside so we'll wait for this to boot up All right, so the progress that's been made is we now have uh, full acceleration of the HD 4000 card uh, thanks to a user by the name of MIDI and the Insanely Mac forum. Um, as you can see, everything looks good, runs full speed. Uh, and I patched the DSDT file for full brightness. It was pretty dim. Uh, the brightness slider also worked. So that's uh, some good progress. Let me open up the Wacom preference pane, which unfortunately says it's not working. I'm going to go ahead and plug in my external uh, 22 to the USB hub. And now this shows up, which seems promising to me, and will hopefully give us insight. Um, go to about this mag. Let's see. System report. USB, and then. The 22HD shows up as well as the 13, well the internal components show up as a Cinti Companion 13HD touch and just uh, this here. I believe USB to UART bridge controller is actually what the side hotkeys are, I'm not sure. Um, but the product ID and vendor ID in here, I patch some kex files with all that stuff put them back in the internal components still aren't working but something I did notice uh, when you push the windows button it acts it seems to act as an alt key you see that little flash up there it's, it's quick but the fact that it is there's some interaction it seems promising um, what else I've got Wi-Fi, because I installed the aftermarket uh, Wi-Fi card. Battery, unfortunately just with an X. Uh, when I installed Voodoo battery, it showed a battery, but 0% and didn't actually function. Sound works, but um, when you use the rocker key, it only works once. And doesn't work again so if anybody knows what's going on with that or how to correct it let me know uh, what else touch touch moves a cursor but doesn't act as a click um, the pen moves a mouse um, the mouse or the pen buttons work but still no calibration because this preference pane doesn't load for the internal components. Um, I opened the registry file for the first time today and there seems to be a lot going on in there that 
I could probably hopefully use to get the internal components working. It's pretty close to being usable once we get that going. So if anybody has any suggestions of what to try or if they want to want me to send them the registration file to look at or um, vendor ID, whatnot, uh, let me know. Good luck to you guys. See you soon.